Yo, what is good everybody? Welcome back to another NBA Live mobile video. We are back on the test server to give you guys an insane preview of the brand new winter campaign, winter promo, winter freeze promo, whatever you guys want to see or whatever you guys want to say. But anyway, first of all, as you guys can see, there's a few things that you guys can see. Um, there is the new flashback player that's going to be JJ Redick. Yo boy, loves JJ Redick. So I'm probably going to finish that. But anyway, the whole point of this video is to talk about the campaign and how it's basically going to work. It is early really early so it's gonna be a very different style of um campaigns or promo compared to the one that we're used to it is gonna be like a month long maybe on to like july july january maybe on all the way to january so we'll see how that goes but it should be interesting let me go ahead and make sure we're in focus right quick bang we should be in focus so first thing you see is there is the campaign map and we're gonna click on the campaign map you're gonna be like oh there's no campaigns that might change right again this should be live tomorrow but we'll see how it goes so it's very simple complete objectives to earn snowflakes trade in snowflakes for snowballs and get a mystery gift which is obviously the presents if they didn't have presents this year i would have been crazy crazy but yeah they have presents and then afterwards you can complete the magic johnson who's 93 overall so we're gonna go ahead and go to the sets in a second you can start opening presents december 24th keep playing to discover more so usually they drop like two two series of presents so we should see we should see in a second what we can get so first of all we go to our set train in 20 snowflakes to get one of these winter balls as well as a mystery gift it could be a coal it could be a present you don't really know so it only takes five snowballs to get to 80 and then 10 snowballs to get 83 and then 15 to 86 30 to 90 and then 50 to 91 i think probably 100 to 8 oh 75 to 92 and then 93 there's a 93 as well wow 100 so to make it all the way right just to make it all the way all right so you need 175 uh 225 255 and then you got another 30 here 255 approximately 300 little bit less than 300 so i'll explain to you guys 300 let's do 300 divided by 10 so it's about 30 so 30 300 divided by 10 sorry, sorry, sorry. 300 the 300 of these times 20 so that's gonna be we'll just do times two so 600 of these packs that will anyway you guys will understand my math in a second so to get these collectibles is very easy there's two ways maybe three ways technically three ways so first of all you guys go to these objectives and just by completing them you can get a lot of snowflakes or for example one of them that i did before which i actually cleared what is just do a set or something along the line so claim the two bonus, you get three snowflakes, you do a layup, you get one, spend 750 stamina. Is that a weekly? No, it's a daily. You can do that pretty easily. And then getting steals to so basically every day. Let me see how many snowflakes you can get. The minimum. So that's seven, ten, twenty-five snowflakes a day just from the objectives. So that's actually pretty good. That's one collectible, at least one collectible a day. So that's not bad. So a pretty cool, unique way. So this way, it, instead of grinding out campaigns, they probably might do a blitz event or so. We're not even sure. But we'll check the store. They have this winter pass thing, which is actually pretty good. It will give you snowflakes, but it also, uh, let's see what it gives you. Okay. With this offer, you receive a seven day access pass, one times 200 snowflakes, get two extra objective every day. So that's actually pretty good. And then you get exclusive bonus pack opening with five snowflakes every day. You can also, obviously, if you want, you can pay cash and snowballs to get five snowball cash and some players for the, um, how much is that? Ten dollars Canadian, which was probably a little cheaper American. I really wish they had these winter players, but maybe again this will come out later. It is pretty early in the promo, so there is going to be a lot more stuff that comes out. You get the starter value pack, which gives you presents. You got a nicer, nicer pack. We got a snowball fight. We're actually going to open a bunch of these packs. We're going to see what we get from it. There is also the bonus pack, which I, I don't even know why I opened it, but it is in my bench. So we're gonna go to my bench and open it. So if you do have any of these saved up, bang, bonus pack. We'll see what's included in the pack. I'm not exactly sure what you can get in this pack, but you, okay, two snowflakes. So you can actually get a lot of snowflakes from doing this. So there is also coin packs. So if we go to store, we show you guys the pack. You can get 10 snowflakes for 10,000. So if we're doing our map before, each pack gives you 10. You need to buy 300 of these packs to finish off the master. 300 times 10,000 is 3 million? I think it's 3 million. 3 million coins to just straight up buy if you grind out every day, which is actually not bad to get a 93 overall. It could be definitely cheaper if you grind out every day. You get the 25 tokens. You need 600, 6,000 of these frost tokens if you get 25 a day. You do 6,000 divided by 3, so that's 70, 750 days. We'll see how it goes. But you get a lot of presents. 
and the present could change. So anyway, we're going to buy this winter snow pass first. We'll see what we get from that. You get the winter snow times 20, and then you get 10 things. Wow, I'm actually interested to see what those 10 things... Oh, you probably just get 20 snowflakes. Yeah, you get 10 snowflakes packs, so we're actually going to open all these. I hopefully have enough space. Because of all the jerseys, I don't have much space, but I can open a few things. So 20 collective, that's basically not bad. So for 700, you can get five, five. You can get five of the snowballs. So you can get 80 overall right off the bat and not to accelerate it. So I might recommend getting it for seven days. I might hold off just a little bit just to see what we can get. Maybe later on, there might be some better stuff you get, but you can get a lot of snowflakes, which should be really nice. So 200 snowflakes for 700 is actually really good. Let's compare it to the other deals that we have here. I just want to double check and make sure that everything seems right. I'm going to run out of space probably on the before last pack. So not this one, probably the one right after. So let's see if I'm correct. Oh, no. All right. I'm going to run out on the last one, most likely. Let's see. And we are full? Question mark? Oh, no, we're not full. Pretty good. I thought we would be full, but... We are going to go ahead. All right. Snow pass unlocks, snow objectives, head to the store for a bonus pack each day. Enjoy your daily objectives. You get the 20 pass, two extra. Very cool. Let's see what's the extra pass pack that we get. Might be in the back or not. Maybe I have to refresh. We'll check. Ah, there we go. You get All right. Before we do that, I think we're going to run out of space. So you get a bonus five a day, which is actually pretty good. So you get overall a lot of, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of stuff. So uh, we're going to go ahead and do these, a few of these. Bang, bang. We got we get to do 10 of them, actually. I don't know why I thought you can only get five. Get 10 of them, which is pretty good. We're gonna see what kind of presents we can get, what kind of cool cool gifts we can get. We got coal. What does the coal do? Use to heat up players. Ah, I like the coal. So what the coal will most likely be doing, it's my prediction, is that there will be um, some winter pres winter pres present promo, Jesus. Winter players are gonna come out. And with those, there's gonna be some training players, just like the level one, and you can use the coals to level them up. I'm just trying to figure out what's the odds of getting the presents, because I'm feeling you would, oh, okay, we got a present. We got a present right off the bat. I will take it. So I wonder if they give you presents for completing sets. If they would give you presents to complete sets, that would be actually really good. Like if, for example, I complete the first one, I get a set. Let's go check it out. We're gonna see, I doubt it, but so we got a coal two out of three times. So I'm gonna open 10 of them to see what the odd. I'm guessing maybe half the time you're gonna get a present, probably 10% of the time getting an elite, maybe a little less odds. So depending on how the odds are and how many elites or presents you get, I think they'll be good presents. There should be some nice presents. If you get a lot of coals, I'm expecting the presents to be pretty decent. As you guys can see, I am not getting too many presents. So I got four coals, one present, so it's not the best odds, I'll be honest with you. Not the best odd to get presents so far. Small sample size, but still, it's like, it doesn't feel good to get that much cold. Hopefully the coals will be pretty good. We'll see what you get. It's just annoying that you're gonna be holding a bunch of coals for a bit, especially if you don't know when the players are coming out. So maybe it is a 10% chance to get a present. We'll see, we'll see. We're gonna go open some more packs afterwards. We'll see what's available and all that cool fun stuff. So quick, I don't want the quick sell. All right, so you know what? We got 100 quick sell. I don't know how to feel about that, but I guess it's like a, it's just a random winter surprise. All right, so I guess it's okay, but still 100, but you can't really complain because it's literally free. You don't really get anything else. Like it's just, it's just getting players, right? Like I think getting the 86 overalls is gonna be super easy. Like just for doing this, this booster pack and then grinding out every day, it should be fairly easy in my opinion. So like just for example, right here, we're gonna get the Magic Johnson to begin with. So I think you only get, so you don't get any present. I wish they would give you some kind of present, just like a reward. You know, they did that kind of similarly in the last promo, whenever you finish this, you get tokens, but it's understandable, it's understandable. So we're gonna actually go look at the stats of the Magic Johnson. I forgot to mention that Magic Johnson is the master player. You have a 93 overall. Card art looks sick. Stat-wise from hindsight, just from like glance to hindsight, jeez. That's not the right word. At glance, it doesn't look too great, but not bad. He's a 6'10 point guard, almost like a Ben Simmons card, but this one's obviously the original card. You know, he is the tall point guard, you know, point. No, he didn't really play point forward, but still, anyway, whatever, 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 whatever. Does he have any boost? It doesn't look like he has any boost, but 6'10, 92 agility, 90 mid range, 89 three point. Again, these stats are not finalized, might change tomorrow. You never know, it is a test server. So, pretty good. So, the stats are not bad, but the art looks very nice. I like it. So this is the only player we see so far. It's definitely going to change. We're going to see what happens as it goes on. Let's go to the store and open a few more packs or let's just check one thing. Let's check what's the bonus. All right. So you do get the snow pass. So you get uh, actually a lot. 25. 
that's a lot. So you can get 25 plus 25, so 50 of these a single day, plus the five you get, so that's 55, plus the, the bonus pack, so approximately 60. So you can get three elite tokens a day if you pay up to every four hours. So four hours, just six of these. Let's say you go to bed every, for six hours, you can buy this approximately five times a day, five times, five times 10, so you get about 120 tokens. You can get 120 divided by 20, you get six elite tokens a day. So six elite tokens, so in 100 days, you could technically finish it if you don't spend too much. I don't know, we'll see. Actually, I'm, I'm actually kind of curious to see how this is. Like, you, you don't really know until you start grinding to see what's available, and then obviously there's gonna be the, the um, presents and all that fun stuff. So let's go ahead and check out what you gotta do. As long as you grind, I like that, that they're making you try to do all these um, objectives. It's very, very, very um, interactive. So we'll see. Anyway, store, we'll see what you can get. You also get your free pack here, which we're gonna open. This is not bad, five for free. It should be daily. It could be maybe every four hours. If it's every four hours, it'd be really, no, it's daily. So this one should be every four hours. You get your 10 snow passes, which is not bad, which is not bad at all. All right, and then I wonder if there's an, oh, it's 24 hours? Oh, man. All right, the odds goes down a little bit. It goes down a little bit. So we're gonna go finish it off with some of these packs. So you get a nicer, nicer pack for 300. I believe you get a present at least. So that's not bad, I might buy this. If you get guaranteed a present, I hope it's not a cool, oh, elite present. 5% chance to get an elite poke present. I will take it. That's really, really nice. 5% to get an elite present. So you definitely wanna to try to gamble it and get it. I wanna see if you guaranteed at least a gold present because if it's not a guaranteed gold present, it might be pretty cheesy. Yeah, so at least you seem, not gold, regular present, regular present. So then you can go ahead and do the snowball fight. You get five of these tokens, which is not bad. So it's de definitely a better value of the, than the um, the other one, that the pass, but the snowball pass is more like a grinding. I love these season pass kind of, kind of thing. So we're gonna actually, let's see what you get. All right, naughty and nice, you get a bag of coal or a gold present, a chance to get a gold present. So I'd rather get the elite one guarantees you a present and then I don't really wanna get a bag of coal, but you get the coal. So I guess, I guess, I guess. So we'll finish it off with this quick bundle. So the cool thing about this, it does give you the, Snowball fight will give you five snowballs. So if you want to pay, it wouldn't cost that much in the long run, I think, but I definitely hold off on buying packs. There might be some better packs coming out later on. So I believe this will give you some snowball packs as well. You can get some nicer, nicer packs and snowball fights. So you get two of the snowball fights and you get two of the present ones. So this bundle is not bad, especially if you're trying to just get presents. So it could be decent. You get some nice elite players. You get some nice snowballs. So you get two and two. So value-wise, it's pretty good considering it's a 700 times two, 1400. So, and what's the topper? You get 7,500. 7, nicer, nicer is 600. So I think it's exactly the same price, but you get exactly, ooh, gold present. Nice, I'll take that. So just like silver present, gold present, and elite present. You got a chance to, I wish, wait, let me see if it tells you the chance of getting gold. So I've actually gotten a few of these. Um, let's see if it clicks on it. So it doesn't really tell you here. So you get one silver present plus. So value-wise, it's about the same value, but you get an extra 75K, which you can spend. So it's decent. I, I think it's not bad, but I want to see the odds of getting the, you know, the snowballs here. So I don't have enough here, but I should be able to make an 83 overall here. And then grinding that out shouldn't be too crazy. You can get an 86 overall pretty easy, in my opinion. The nine overall should be fairly easy. 30 is not that bad. Once you get to the 75, I think might be a little hard. So you could probably get the 91 pretty easily, no money spent. 93, maybe not, 92, maybe. It is a month promo, so. There, there, there should be very, very interesting, and uh, we'll, we'll see how it goes. All right, that's it for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about the promo so far. Again, it is just the tip of the iceberg. Literally, it's winter, so it's gonna freeze. It is gonna be a lot more, I hope, most likely. It, they, they told me that it's only the small part of it. There's gonna be a lot more, obviously. It's definitely gonna be like some players that comes out and all that crazy stuff. So let me know what you guys think. If you wanna see my latest video, gonna be on the right side of the screen. If you haven't yet, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and make videos on it daily. All right, I'm out. See you guys next time. Kill it.